Thanks to recent numbers, we have a better idea of the Sioux Falls School District's diversity. In tonight's Eye on Cal Land, we're bringing you a closer look at a group at one school that's helping students feel more comfortable in their new home. We introduced you to Roosevelt High School senior Kiara Casillas Carrillo last month during this roundtable discussion for National Hispanic American Heritage Month. She, along with fellow Roosevelt senior Janet Constantino, started a student group called Latinos Unidos last year, which translates to Latinos United. We try and help the students that are Latin American that come from their countries to make them feel more comfortable with our school and the environment. We just like talk to them about like things that are going on like with school, like school activities. We want them to feel comfortable, make them feel safe. Courtney Saul is a school home liaison with the Sioux Falls School District. They noticed that there's these new students coming, brand new from other countries with zero English, zero understanding of what is school in South Dakota like. And they were like, you know, we need to help them. We've been through this. Well, some of them been through this and they're like, we want to mentor them and give them a place where they can come and feel safe and ask questions in Spanish. Roosevelt Jr. Oscar Diaz is a part of the group. I think it's like more or less a family. He was born in Puerto Rico but came here because of Hurricane Maria. Constantino's parents are from Mexico but she was born in Sioux Falls. Casillas Carrillo has one parent from Mexico and one from Guatemala while she was born in Iowa. This diversity is reflected in Latinos Unidos. You know, they all speak Spanish, but the diversity just within is extreme. You know, we have Colombia from Puerto Rico, Guatemala, and so there's so much diversity just within our group um, that it's really good to come together and kind of talk about those differences and similarities and how we can all help each other. Latinos Unidos has grown, too. Started with 15, now we grew to like 50, 50 60 kids. The word spread around and like a lot of other kids thought it was cool so they just like came here and just okay. participated with us. Sioux Falls School District Superintendent Brian Maher says there is a connection between diversity and youth in the district. So our middle schools are more diverse than our high schools and our elementary schools are more diverse than our middle schools. So this isn't just a bubble. This is our new reality as a city our new reality as a school district. We are becoming more and more diverse. For students at Roosevelt, having a group like Latinos Unidos means self-worth, Casillas Carrillo says. I feel it makes them be proud of who they are. Check out this story at kelland.com. We will have a breakdown of students' different ethnicities in the Sioux Falls School District.